Hey guys, I'm Lily. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be trying on prom dresses. I'm doing a huge try on haul from Zalando with lots of different prom dresses from different brands. So let's go and get started with this video. Corsets have been so fashionably like, especially like one or two years ago, but I think they're still like really trendy and I love a corset. Trying on all these dresses really makes me feel like a princess. I love it. They're all super long and flowy. So corset dress, thought it would be cute. I also love the glitter. Like it looked kind of like the night nice sky and I think it's so pretty, it's so long and flowy and beautiful. So long and flowy and beautiful. It's so, so pretty, flowy, love it. I have to say, I've been wearing this for literally a minute and I feel so itchy and scratchy, I like, don't like that. So it's not very comfortable. It's very, very cute. Like I think definitely a solid option. I wish it did a little bit more maybe boys because the corset things look like they're gonna be supportive, but they're not really. It's a little, large in this area here but i think with boob tape i could probably finesse a good little situation there so yeah really cute great option this is from press da it's definitely like i think a size too big but cute and flattering and super nice and flowy like cinches the waist which i love of course and then super nice and flowy below. Like the dress just spins around. This is just too big. This is a size 38 and generally I'm a size 36 in dresses that honestly depends on the dress. Some sizes weren't available, so I just got a size up. Yeah, I'm also super short. I need to disclaim that when you guys see me, like these all, I haven't tried a dress on yet that hasn't been too long, which is fine. I'm not really short. I'm 1 meter 63, which is five foot four, question mark. I don't do weird units of measurement. Mm -hmm. like a princess but in like a good way not in a patriarchy toxic masculinity i have no right way and i love it shockingly i have found a dress that is not too long for me mostly because the front part it goes to my knees and then the back goes down all the way which i think is really cute but i have to say i do not like this dress i don't know if this is how it was made i don't know if it's supposed to be like this but this just seemed really loopy and like it's just hanging in all the weirdest wrongest places and then the top has like no support so like i could figure that out but it's too large not very flattering in any of the spots. Not the princess feel. Definitely not a win from me. This dress is from Massimo Dutti and I'm kind of in love. Wow, that is a really, really pretty dress. I love this color. This is like what attracted me from to the dress in the first place. The lilac is so pretty. It also has a leg slit. It's also too long, which is why I'm stepping on everything. Don't love that the leg slit, it comes from like this knot, so it's in the center and I don't, Love that. It's so cute. Definitely would need some work in the boob areas. It feels so like smooth though. Yeah, I don't know how much I could even do with this dress. I do like this knot. I think it's cute, a cute little detail, but this is very cute. Also, am I crazy? Maybe it's the snow or does this bring up my eyes? I think it's the snow. It's cute. It's a little loose as well, which this is actually the right size. I think it's a size 36. I think it's just because of my boobs. Like I don't have the largest boobs in the world. So this dress is from uh, Star and Night. I don't love it. I definitely messed up putting it on somehow. I think it's like generally just too big. It's very, very long and it doesn't really do anything in the boobage area. It's like, it's really, really big in that area. It does have a leg slit, which is nice, but it's not in like the nicest place. So here it is in all its glory. It is a cute dress. I think like someone could definitely pull it off really, really nicely. It's just not for me. I don't love the, like I like it here. I don't love it below the waist either. Definitely not a bad dress, just not the dress for me. This dress is from Star Night and I actually like wish it fit better because it's kind of so cute. It is also a little bit large. Um, I could definitely make it work. And it has a leg slit, which again, I'll show you in a second. It's quite cute. It just makes me feel a little like, not large, not like, I don't know. It makes, uh, like I wish it was, a little, the waistline is like too high. I wish it was a little lower because it would be more flattering on my waist and just a little more fitted in that way. Cause I think it would be so, so much flatter because it is a really, really cute dress. So here it is, again, has a leg slit and I like the placement of this one much more, I have to say. I do feel so like, princessy and cute in these dresses. Also, probably not the one. As I'm getting changed, I am realizing that I am literally in a room where on three sides it's windows. So anyone just walks by, they can see me. I mean, 
There's a fence. You can't really see me from the street, but you could if you walked into my garden. Because I'm smart and I make good life choices. So these are the only two green dots that I have. And I'm actually kind of sad I'm not keeping one of them. Because what I love about green is I have blue green eyes. I'll just a picture of my eyes because they're literally like the outside, like the blue eyes, but then the inside, the inner circle, the inner circle is green. I have like heterochromia. My mom has blue eyes, my dad has green eyes. I inherited half of each. But anyway, green brings out my eyes. Like if I wear green, it'll bring out my eyes, which I really love. So I wish, I wish this would bring out, I wish I could wear a green dress because it brings out my eyes. So I love that. And then blue, there's so many blue dresses. I love blue. Doesn't bring out my eyes as much. It's more when I like have blue reflected at me that it brings out my eyes, which also snow. Snow will bring out my eyes, the blue out of my eyes and like blue reflected at me. So in water, great. Kind of would have loved a green dress, but that's okay. We have so many other options. I literally, it's insanity. I'm gonna insert a video right here of how it looks. Welcome to our segment called grab a snack. Make sure you grab yourself a snack and we're gonna eat it together. Treat yourself because you deserve it. I am eating a cowboy mix today. I don't actually know what this is, but it tastes kind of like a mom, if you know that. So, love. This dress is so heavy. There's like four layers, I'm not even kidding. But oh my God, I think this is my favorite so far. I love it. It's so cute, so flattering. Snatches the waist and then expand into this ginormous, beautiful, like, silky thing. Like, look at that beauty. Like a princess, there's so much fabric, so much material. It has pockets. It is so cute. Feels really silky here, and then the rhinestones here are really nice. It's a little itchy, like, by the armpits and stuff, but nowhere near as bad as the other one was. Like, I think I could be fine in this. I think this is my favorite so far. Comment down below what your favorite is so far, or just generally, and which one you would buy, and which one you think I should wear from. I kind of love it. I feel so princessy. I love it. Okay, so there's some space available. My sister tried this dress on, and we're twins, and she is, like, much bigger boobs than me. I don't know why. Literally perfect on her and not me, so. But it is really cute. Also, I love that the leg slit is in the right place. Love. Love. This dress is so beautiful. It's giving bejeweled Taylor Swift. Wow, it is so pretty. It's like a silver color, but reflects blue because the inside is blue. And it's so pretty. A little different from the other ones because it's tight through the thighs and then is like loose and flowy and beautiful. I love this dress. Boobs are less supported though, I have to say. Like from here, this I think this just comes too high and I don't know if I like to fix that. I don't know, it just feels like this is like not supposed to be this high, it's supposed to be lower. Structurally has some issues, so I don't know if this could be the one because of that. I love these little folds. I think they'll make it really flattering and just very cute. This dress is also so cute. It reminds me of the dress I tried on a few dresses ago, the, uh, the one that was also like, it was silk in the bottom though, it had a slit. This one does not, it's like tully though. There's so much fabric. Again, I literally had to stick my hand through the top to figure out where to access the dress. It is so cute. Oh, the sun decided to join us. Wow. Might make taping the boobs a little more difficult. Quite really cute. I think the other one was just a little more flattering in the top section though. Also has a nice waist, which I love. Oh my god. I love this. Oh my god. It's so cute. So flat. Wow. It's like the light blue one, but I think better. Wow, that is a gorgeous dress. It's a little bit of a brighter blue, and then the sparkles are also a little bit brighter. Wow. Definitely would have to get it short. I do have fairly high heels I could wear it with, but I think even then, I have to get like a little bit taken off because I just don't want to be tripping on it. But it is very cute. It's so... I love this dress. This is the very last dress. Comment down below what dress do you think I should choose? What dress do you think I will choose? Which one's your favorite? So yeah, here you have it. I've had all the brands on the screen and I also have Zyla in the link down below so you can check them out if you want one of these dresses. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you want me to do more try on hauls or shopping hauls like this. And yeah, I love you guys so much. Keep loving and keep smiling. Bye.